Hey, what's up guys? Vika2 here. And I just thought I would do a unboxing. Um, never did one before, but this is my first one. And I'm recording this with the new iPad, so I wanted to see how great this camera is. It seems to be really good. It takes really good pictures. Uh, and the uh, video is supposedly like 1080p, so it's really good uh, quality camera now. Anyway, got this in the mail the other day, and uh, I'm going to do an unboxing. Been waiting for this for a uh, uh, couple of months, and finally it's here. It's from my buddy Jeff over in uh, on the mainland. I'm, I'm here in Hawaii, so I've um, uh, been waiting for this for a while, and I'm really happy to, to finally get it here. Anyway, I'm going to open this up. Okay. Okay. Now I'm going to slowly unbox this thing here. All right. There we go. What do we have in here? <clears throat> Let me pull this thing out. This looks like the... Um, These old scales on my knife. Some G10 scales in here. I got my, I had my uh, Emerson and my uh, Spyderco military <coughs> pimped by um, Tough Thumbs. So, first one out. Let's check this out. I got to do everything one handed just because of the way the camera is situated. Um, so, bear with me. It just seems awkward. Okay, what do we have here? We have something wrapped up in a napkin. It's a little tape. Really tough looking shop napkin there. <laughs> okay, there we go. Let me put that in the middle of the camera here. What's this? Oh, check this out, guys. Wow, that is amazing, huh? Heck, that's awesome, dude. That is nice, man. I actually f saw this when he um, was doing videos on uh, on his uh, channel, uh, Tough Thumbs. But, you know, just to see it in person, to finally get it, it's just amazing. It feels great in the hand. Wow. Check that out. This is a tan and... Um, Tan and brown, you know, scales. Um, wow, this is deluxe, man. And I told him do something black in there. He did a um, this uh, backspace here that really, you know, pulls everything together. And the black theme. I think it looks great, man. Awesome job, Jeff. Okay, little Anzo pattern going on. Almost has a wood grain kind of a thing going on there. Wow, that's awesome. Looks really nice with the black blade. I really like this. Okay. So let me just get this crap out of the way. And, uh,. I'm going to need the box there, so I'm just going to pull the stuff out, and I'll unfold in front of you guys, so see how that works. Okay, that's knife number one. This is knife number two. This is my Emerson CQC15. Uh, I'm a big Emerson fan. Some people don't like Emerson. You know, they're always complaining about the fit and finish. Um, I, you know, this is going to be my go-to thing for um, to defend myself, to defend my life. So I just want something that works. And Emerson's by far, it's one of the strongest folders out there. And wow, look at that. Look at that. This is done in carbon fiber. It's just standard carbon fiber, but look, look at that. Oh my God. 
I told him to, to kind of fix up the finish on this thing, and he, he just about polished everything on here. From the screws, the pivot screw, the pocket clip, he, he put on the polisher, and look at that. Look at that. Look at the finish on this thing. I, he added this titanium backspacer. And well, some people might disregard that and they might not think much of it. But, you know, on a uh, on an Emerson knife, this is, this is totally deluxe, man. You spend some big bucks just to put a titanium whatever on there. And he uh, did a great job at cutting and milling this thing. And just, you know, the precision... That I could see that went into it. Let me uh, focus in there a little bit better. See that precision there? That's just beautiful. It feels great. Feel it's so smooth, you know. And at first I wanted to get the um, um, I wanted to get a pattern on this thing like he's been doing the reptilian. But I kind of like how it is now. I think I think it's great, you know. It's like I don't need something really super aggressive to hold on to this thing. Yeah, I think I could probably um, skin somebody, you know, without cutting myself. So, I mean, that is an awesome pimp job, man. It looks almost factory. And yet it, it has that kind of custom look to it and that's right I, I like that a lot <laughs> love the blade love the CKC 15 blade has a bit of Tonto and a little bit of the uh, recurve for the commander and uh, it's, it's, it's my favorite um, yeah definitely one of my favorite blades out there I got a roadhouse coming so hopefully I can send that out to him and maybe do some some more work on it, do some pimping on it. Um, check out his uh, YouTube videos, uh, Tough Thumbs. He did one in a marble carbon fiber that was just totally sick. And I think I'm going to do get my uh, my Super Roadie out there for him to put some uh, some marble carbon fiber on it for me. And I, I'll probably keep it smooth too. Do the same thing with the uh, titanium. Hopefully he can do that for me. Anyway, um, these two knives, man. Awesome. What can I say? It's just, it's just sick pimp jobs. You know, for lack of a better word, dude, sick. This is sick. <laughs> anyway. Hope the video turns out all right. Man, check that out. I'm at eight minutes. I got like a minute left. So I can upload this video. Amazing. Okay. Let's see how I do that on on now. Backspacer. There we go. I just like it. Looks like shark skin or something. Like fish scales. Looks cool, man. What can I say? This thing looks freaking cool. I love it, man. Thanks, Jeff. Awesome job. And hopefully, I'll have enough. Guts to put this on YouTube. Okay, well, until next time, I'll uh, try to get better at this unboxing and reviews and stuff. And maybe I can have a channel of my own. Anyway, take care, guys. Aloha.